Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to or welcome back to the channel. Basemos here. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at the Timpano Audio TPT T3500D2. Uh, this is a 12 inch subwoofer, uh, 1750 RMS and uh, 3500 watts max. This thing looks like a beast. And we are going to only, we're all, in this video, we're only going to unpackage, uh, unbox it and uh, go look around, look, look at it, you know, and uh, look at all the features on it. But before I get into that, guys, huge shout out to Timpano Audio for sponsoring the channel and uh, helping me achieve these types of videos. And uh, yeah, I, I will have a lot more Timpano Audio stuff coming here shortly. Um, I have two of these TPT 3500s and I have big plans for it in the future with Timpano Audio. And guys, if you really, if you want to help the channel out, go look at my um, affiliates down below. Here's a short video of that. Hey guys, if you want to help the channel out, the affiliate links will be down in the description for Redoto Power, Power Queen, Slops Audio, Sirwin Vega, and Big Jeff Audio. Go down in the description and you can go look at the code uh, for 5% off on your order. Alright, back to the video. Alright guys, with that out of the way, let's get into the unboxing of the Timpano Audio subwoofer. This is the biggest one they actually make, well except the 15 inch, but this is the biggest model they make. So let's get into it. Alrighty guys, let's look at the side of the box. So overall diameter of the subwoofer is 12.79 inches. It's pretty beefy. And the mount baffle cutout, so the holes you have to cut for this sub is going to be 11.18 inches. It's really nice that subwoofer companies actually put this stuff on the box because if you make boxes or you want to buy a box, you got to have the right... Um, cut out for it otherwise the sub will either be too small or too big and uh yeah you just don't really want to get into that all right guys switching the box around let's see so x max 29 millimeters of x max 2.2.28 peak the peak guys that is a really good x max number and uh i'm really excited because the timpano tpt 2500 i know they get down low and that's what i'm rocking in the car right now so i just I can't imagine what, what this one will sound like. All right, guys, twisting the box the last time. This is what I really like to see. So this is going to be a two ohm voice, uh, dual voice coil, uh, just casual two ohm. I'm going to be hooking it down the half an ohm because I got two of these. And uh, here's here's what we got. USA made voice coil, three inch voice coil, eight layer flat al black aluminum wire, guys. That is crazy good. And uh, yeah, the what I really like about these Tempano subwoofers is that they also carry recones on their store um which is really nice to see so if you do blow a sub you can actually go to their store and recone it I know a lot of subwoofer companies that that do not do that and uh it does not break the bank either which is really nice to see all right guys without further ado let's get this thing out of the box Alrighty, guys taking it out of the box here look at this beautiful 12 inch subwoofer now like I said this is going to be Tempano's highest tier subwoofer that they actually make and uh, it's the biggest model so without further ado let's just get into this and uh break it down all right guys so first thing i notice is that the that it uses a uh, ti frame and the voice goal has a lot of cooling which i really like to see and this voice goal guys is beautiful the eight layer black aluminum USA made voice coil, crazy, crazy, crazy. And the uh, what I also noticed is that when I push it down, the spider is very stiff, so I'm gonna have to break this thing in pretty well. Not only that the spider is glued, but it's also screwed down, guys, which is, this, this thing should not be going anywhere. Another thing I really like to see, there are two tinsel leads going to the coil and uh, these things are pretty beefy too. Uh, they are not flat tinsel leads. They are pretty thick wire, as I can see. And another thing I really like about this sub, guys, these these terminals. Now, guys, these are four gauge terminals. Here, I got some scar wire. Let me show you. All right, guys. So this is scar wire, four, scar four gauge wire. And uh, yeah, let's put it in the terminal. Sorry, guys. I couldn't film that part because it I couldn't do it one handed. But as you can see, it fits the four gauge wire perfectly. And guys, this is a big thing when it comes to subs. You need very, very high gauge wire when you're running this much 
power through a subwoofer or multiple subwoofers. So I really like to see that. The, and another thing is it's on a aluminum for, uh, former, which I like to see. It's, let's see, the magnet. All right, guys, so this magnet, um, it doesn't say the size of the magnet on the website, but I know it's a triple stack ma magnet. I wish they put the, the ounces on the, on the actual website so I actually know. But this thing, trust me when I say this, this thing's pretty beefy. All right, guys, flipping over, you have the Timpano logo and then the model of the sub, and it actually has voice coil cooling vent right here, and you also have some vents right here for the motor and guys that's really nice to see because these motors do get really hot all right guys turning it back around here the uh, surround is very beefy i really like that they have pretty 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 well made foam surrounds another thing that i notice is that it has a great carbon fiber dust cap guys uh, that has tympano engraved into it and guys another thing that I noticed is when I looked at the recones on this thing, it actually has a three inch compression cap for the voice coil. I think it's called a compression cap and uh, that's supposed to help it more with cooling. I'm pretty sure if I'm wrong about that, let me know down in the comments if you're more familiar with it. And uh, but I know a lot of big subs have them and it's good to have. Overall, guys, this sub looks like a beast, and I'm sure it will be a beast. Like they say on the website, this thing is great. Quality you can trust. Tempano slogan. Guys, if you like this video and want to see more of this subwoofer, I'll be breaking it in. I'll be putting it to the test with the others. I'll be putting it in the car, do a DP test, a watt test, anything you could think about. Think about. Leave them down in the comments if you want to see more of this. And uh, yeah, guys, this thing is beautiful and I can't wait to get it in the car. All right, peace, guys.